measuring out. So we got two per group, and then two. Who's responsible for your happiness? You. 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 Where are you going to spend the next four years of high school? Where Where do you want to go? The most important thing to me is the climate of the school. This is a place where all types of students are safe. They're safe here, and I think they feel that. I think that's the biggest, greatest attribute about our school. Teachers, they definitely want you to succeed. They'll do anything in their power to help you. You can ask a teacher for anything, and they'll break their back to help you to some extent, of course. But if you're not in that mindset of, I want to have a good future, they're not, they can't really do much more than that. It really is student driven. You have to want to be here. You have to want to have a good future. You have to want a connection with your teacher to allow them to want to help you back. Having relationships, you know who to talk to, right? Like, it, it'd be more weird for you to come up to someone random when already talking to them than to already speak with someone you already know. So, and again, building trust and building relationships is a pretty good foundation at the school. It, it gives me a sense of pride and a sense of responsibility. I want to make sure this school continues to be a success. We have to work hard for those high scores and it's those close relationships we develop with the students that help us get there. Almost like, well, you're either going to make it or you're not. That is not the feeling here at all. It's more, you know, what can we do to help? Most of the teachers' cars are here after mine. They will stay and help students as much as that student wants that help. You don't have to be incredibly smart to be successful here. You just have to work hard. The only requirement of students is that they have a desire to learn and are motivated to do well. We're a high-performing school, but that doesn't mean all our kids come in here at high-performing levels. While it might be rigorous, it's not tedious. You're not being asked to do mindless work. You are being asked to do work that is going to involve your critical thinking skills, and you're going to learn. We are now an outstanding school. We're nationally recognized as a Blue Ribbon School. And it's our job and our mission to lift them up and get them ready for full-time college in just two years, the two years that we have with them here in this building. You gotta stick with those kids because now when they're 22, 23 years old, they're like, this is the best decision they made in their life was to come here. There's something good in everybody and, and they're all struggling with their own thing and we just gotta be there for them every day. It's amazing to see students grow and change because when they sit in my class as a freshman, they look at me and they don't quite believe everything I'm saying. And then they come to their junior year and then they come to their senior year and they come to those aha moments like, she was right, time goes really fast. Students need the opportunities to develop as a person as much, if not more, than as a student. This also isn't a time for parents to say, oh, they finally made it to high school and wipe their hands and walk away. We can support our children through high school without being helicopter parents. We can teach them to advocate for themselves. We can show them the habits that are necessary to be successful in school that will carry over to be successful in life. You can't, you, you gotta come and spend a little time here. You, you have to, you have to experience it for yourself because what some person experiences is not the same thing you're going to experience. And to hear one negative remark um, or a couple even and to say, oh, we're not going to go there because we heard this, you know, it's just like everything else. It's just such a positive environment. There, There is no, I don't think there's any comparison. I've been teaching for 36 years and I think our kids flourish because teachers have freedom and support here. I think they need to be here. If I could actually physically bring them here to to experience the school one day, I think a lot of misperceptions would be squelched. Like, is this what you want to do, right? Are you? Do you want to move at, at a faster pace? Do you want to wrap up the traditional high school experience in two years and then be dual enrolled and have a lot of flexibility with your time and your schedule, right? Does that interest you? So really kind of thinking about what you think you might want out of high school at this point in time. And then really thinking about 
is this something that I want to do? Do I think this will be a good fit for me based on what I've done in the past? It really comes at, to that decision. Am I ready for that? Am I ready for that kind of challenge on that? And so I just think it's important for students to have a voice in that decision. We're all just kids. The biggest thing that kids want to feel is to feel loved and is to feel supported. And FSWC encourages this environment. And this is the kind of culture that this day and age needs to foster unlimited support and courage. And they encourage you to step out of your comfort zone, to be someone who you never thought you could be. They fill you up with such potential and they get you ready for your future. And if you just waste that precious time, those four years where nothing really matters except for your schooling and your relationships, then you're just gonna regret it for the rest of your life. So if you wanna come here, know that you will be supported and you will be loved and you will be encouraged because they want you to succeed and they want you to be the best version of yourself that you can be. So when you look back, you see them standing there still because you've come so far. We are creating a high school experience for a student that they're going to have for the rest of their life. Florida Southwestern Collegiate High School.